What you doing, Granddad? Just finishing a little paperwork, and all done. Okay, Huey, so I'm going to need you to read through this. What's this? List of rules and procedures for your spot at the market. Oh, okay. All right, Granddad, I'll finish with my breakfast now. I'm ready to roll to my new jizzob. Now hold on there. Before we go anywhere, I want you to read this. What's all this? Like I told Huey, it's rules and procedures. Rules and procedures? Granddad, we your grandkids, you gon' treat us like you don't know us? You thought because we're family I'm supposed to treat you guys like we're at home. No, there's going to be some rules of regulations at my market for all my workers. Huey, can you believe this? Yes, I can believe it, Granddad's the chief of the market. Now read the damn rules. Man, this is a bunch of crap. I'm going to continue making my morning shake. You know, Granddad, if you ever get sick of Riley with his arrogant behavior, you can always terminate him. Well, are my boys ready to go to work today? We are ready, Ida. Just reading the rules and procedures. That's good for you guys. Okay, Granddad, all done with the rules, and I can follow all of them. Good boy. Hey, I ain't no dog. What? So here we are, little kid, on our way to work. Yay, great, great. Hey, guess what, G? Maybe one day we can ask Granddad can he get us a raise, and we should go on a vacation. No way, Riley. Why not? Because weren't you the one who dropped out of school? Man, I thought we was over that. Granddad hired me to work at the market, and I'm going. Yay, but it's gonna take us a lot for Granddad to give us a raise or take a vacation. Yay, I can see. Put some ice cream in my shake. I like ice cream shakes, please. Pour some milk in the shake. Then you pour some marshmallows in the shake. Then you put some honey grams in the shake. First you wanna rip it into little itty bitty pieces, then you wanna stir it up to make it look smooth. Then you wanna put some whipped cream in the shake, just to add a little more taste. Then you wanna add some eggs in the shake, just so that no one will beg for some of the shake. What? Did you just put eggs in your shake? Yay. Is that wrong? Yes it is. What Huey? What is so bad about putting eggs in your shake? Nothing. Nothing at all. I'll be in the living room. Then everyone's favorite part, turn the blender on and then... Be sure to put the blender top on before powering on. Or else you make a big, big mess. Well here we are G, the family market. Granddad's store. Yay, Granddad's store. Look Riley we need to talk about a few things. Like what, what's up? That's exactly what we need to talk about, professionalism. Huey, there's no time to be rolling your eyes, listen, we're only cashiers, okay? We're cashiers and stalkers actually. We're not here to be playing superstore, or young and hungry. Two broke girls not even in the cut, we ain't here to be like none of those business sitcoms you watch on TV. We don't have to be like it, cause we already something like them. No Riley seriously, we're nothing like them. They might act unprofessional, but we don't. So our job is make our money, do what we're told, don't cause any trouble, you gon' watch your temper with customers. Watch my temper? You're gonna also, yes watch your temper? You're gonna not yell at the customers, you're for darn sure not gonna cuss the customers out. It's the early 2020s. Negroes are sensitive nowadays. That's the problem. They can take their bad feelings back to their moms. And you better not even dare, 
drag me into any of your horrible situations. Look Huey, this is a job we doing, not an adventure, this some legit real stuff, I'ma tell you something, I'm not gonna have anybody talking mess towards me, everybody's here to get what they want or what they need, and everybody know who I am, I'm not just Riley Freeman to everyone, to some people I'm Young Reezy, Da Fundraiser. Okay are you finished? Yay. Okay. Huey, there's a lady you guys will be meeting. She's the assistant director of the store. Her name is Lucy. As a matter of fact, I want you guys to follow me. I'm going to introduce her to you guys right now. Okay. Hi Lucy, how are you? Oh hi Robert, I'm fine, how are you? Good, good. Hey Lucy, these are my boys, my grand boys. These are the two new workers of the market. Huey, Riley, this is Lucy. This is the lady I was talking to you guys about. Hi. Lucy. Hi. Huey. Hi. Riley. Wow. Good hugger ha ha ha. Can I ask you a question? Sure. Never mind him, he's just being stupid. So Lucy? Yes. Riley and I are willing to learn how to be a cashier and a stalker. And I'm willing to show you guys. First let's take a look around the store shall we? Hi baby, how's work going for the boys? Hi sweetheart, work's going well. The boys are getting tutored by the assistant. Oh nice nice. Just letting you know, we all out of meat. There's no meat for me to cook at home at all. Excuse me, how dare you cut me in line like that? The line's behind me. I just need to ask a quick question, I'll move. No 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 ask a quick question my ass. Get to the back of the line. Well you're not purchasing anything. So why should I move out of the way? Because I was up here first before you came in. You need to be a generous customer and wait in line. Well I don't see any items on the register. Sir just wait in line like she said so there won't be any trouble. Matter of fact get out. Get out. Get the hell out of here. Funky ass. Tell me about it. So you knew Robert for a few months? Yep you should have seen the look on his face when he first saw me. His eyeballs almost popped out of his eyes and through his glasses. Word. Yeah I was like, look I'll give you whatever it is you want from me just don't make your eyes pop out. <laughs> you know you a funny person you know that? Ha 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 likewise. Ha 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 likewise. I can't even get her age and phone number. Hi. I have a question. Do you guys sell any pregnancy test products? Pregnancy test products? You pregnant? Um. No. My mother is. Yo mama pregnant? Girl yo mama know how to get her freak on. Okay why are you doing this? Girl let me tell you something. When my mama was pregnant she thought she was gonna have twins. Know what I'm saying girl? Okay I'm going to ask someone else. You're beginning to scare me. Riley. What are you doing? Nothing just interacting with the customer. Do you guys sell pregnancy tests? I'm sorry, we don't. Thank you love. You're welcome, have a good day. You too. What about me? I interacted with you. Will you stop playing around and act like a worker for once? I was being a worker, I was talking to her about mama being pregnant. Don't be sharing her business with everyone foo. Huey I only shared one thing about moms with one customer. You act like I told her she lived in a shelter for almost 15 years. Riley, either you do right or granddad's gonna fire you. This is where we go for our lunch break. Wow! This is a nice place. Word. It is though. Huey we need to start coming here more often. Yay, we do.
This where all the weird people go. Hey Daisy. Daisy. Oh, hi Lucy. Hi. Hey I brought two newcomers. Today's their first day working at the family market. Huey, Riley, that's Daisy. She's the waitress of the diner. Hi. Huey. Riley. Oh, you're a hugger. Yes! Today's our first day. I'd just like a root beer float. Please. Coming right up. Would you like anything? Nothing really, just a lemon lime soda. Coming right up. Today's going great. Gee, today we got to meet two of the most prettiest workers. I'm happy to hear you liking it. Riley, what's been making you act so different lately? Why you ask that? I'm straight. Riley, you're not. Ever since we made the first appearance of meeting Lucy, you've been acting different. You like her. Say what? You trippin'. I ain't trippin'. It's true. You like Lucy. No, I don't. Classical denial. How do you figure I like Lucy and I don't even know her like that? Come on, little kid. When we shook hands with her, you yanked her under your arms. I mean, you pulled her like you wanted to smash her. Well, it didn't mean I like her. I just wanted to hug her. Here is you guys' beverages. Riley likes you. Not funny, Huey. You like me? In a friendly way. I do. Ha 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 ha. I'm loving you guys already. But seriously, you are not alone about it. A lot of my old co-workers used to say they like me. Word? Yeah. I don't ever get tired of listening to it. My baby sister does. Sounds like somebody's jealous of you. Yep. She hates that I have a really cute face, really nice breasts, sexier legs and a normal shape sized bottom, and all of that of hers is small. She's jealous of me, I make her sick. She'll get over it, it'll come. Yeah that's what I try to tell her, she don't listen. I'll be right back. Damn what a load of jealousy she got towards her big sister. I mean with her having a pretty face, nice breasts, beautiful legs and a sexy behind she should be the daughter of WWE's Stacy Keebler. Yay, sound like her sister is a child. I mean she's jealous because she has a small ass though. I mean let me tell you something, if I was a hoe, I would rather have a small ass than have a big one. You wanna know why? Because if a man passes you, and he looks at your butt, and he expects that he'll see a big one. Therefore you'll know that you have a little one. Understand? I'm going back to the market. Listen to me. You come here every time paying for things and you don't have enough. I'm gonna let it go one last time. Next time I'm gonna throw you out. Do I make myself clear? Yes da, I got you next time for sure. No I'm not your da. You say yes sir or yes Mr. Freeman? Yes. Mr. Freeman. Okay, you're dismissed. A wash up in homeboy. What's up homie? Boy granted this job is one hell of a great one. Have you met the waitress at the diner? Man she is pretty bra. Yes I have met the waitress at the diner. You're talking about Daisy. Yeah she is really nice. Man I would love to get her to be little Mrs. Riley Freeman. <laughs> Don't you even dare Mr. Chick Magnet. You don't even know if she is married or not. I know, that's why I ask her. I'm going back to my office. Daisy plus Riley. Daily. Or would we be? Rilezy? Hey kid, can I ask you a question? What's up? Do you guys sell any dairy products? Um, yes we do, it's all in the back. 
butter, milk, eggs, whipped cream, cheese, coffee cream, ice cream, everything. Yay thank you thank you, I'll go take a look. Hey is that old guy here? What old guy? He wears glasses and wears a yellow tie. Oh. He's not here right now I'm running the register at the moment. Oh okay. Empty your register. What? I said empty your register. Why do you want me to do that? Don't ask me why just open the damn register. Um. I don't know how to open it. You're working as cashier and you don't know how to open the register? Well because um. My boss didn't teach me how to open it. But he told me how to thuggy. Look I don't give a lion's tail what your stupid boss taught you. Open the register or I open your chest. Bruh you can just demand me to open the register. Open it. I said open it. Now. There. Happy? The feds. You press the alarm button. Wait 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 wait. Me press the alarm button. Now you know that's false because if we had one I would have pressed it for something major. Know what I'm saying? Bull crap. Comment acknowledged. Riley. Everything's straight? No everything's not straight. This man's Trina. Be friends with him. Uh huh. What's really going on? Why is the register opened? He's jacking us Huey. He's jacking us. You're not going anywhere punk. Put your hands in the air. What are you a cop? Screw you. Give me all the money Lil Bow Wow. The hell you know about Lil Bow Wow? What the hell is going on in here? He's trying to jack me granddad. Blast home. I thought I told you to get out of my store. Why don't you mind your own business old man? I got your old ma. Granddad. No. Shut up! Now back to what we was doing. Here he is, officer. This is the guy right here. Hands in the air. What's the problem now? You're under arrest? That's the problem. That's right, one time do your job. I'm telling you guys, officers, I didn't do anything. I was just asking the kid there do he sell any dairy products, and he got all scared of me. I'm a real nice guy. He's lying, officers. Just get him out of here. You little snitch. You did this to me. Yeah, I did it. Get out. That's right, get out of here. And don't come back. Busta. This our store. Not yours. Next time my granddad gun blast you. Riley. Cool off. He's gone. Oh thank you Lucy, you saved me. You have no idea what he could have done to me. He could done any. Riley, I know. I've been around a whole bunch of them. Word? Yes, I know how to deal with them. Wow, you're good at it. I'm glad Granddad picked you as the store's assistant director. Thank you, I'm always gonna have you and your brothers back. We'll do the same for you. Dang he smacked me hard, man you good little kid. Yeah I'm good G, you straight yourself he smacked you like he was a fly. Yeah, yeah. Hey, I'm proud of you, brah. You handled that pretty well. But Lucy was the one who called the feds. Not that. I'm talking about before she called them. But I was scared, brah. Riley, enough with that. At least you tried. Yeah, I did. Good looking out, though, G. Anytime, little kid. Thinking about Lucy again? Nah, I was thinking about something else. Why it feel like we forgot somebody. Who? Oh. Granddad. Man, I'm telling you, Huey, if he was there when I was getting jacked. Bruh, I was about to clone comb in his jaw and show home what kind of a Chicago kid I was. You know us Chicago Negroes, G. Yay. But you told me Lucy called the feds, though. Yay, yay, she did. You know what she said? She said she gonna always have our backs. And I told her we gonna always have hers. Yeah we will. 
and you know something? I hugged Lucy twice today, and guess what? Your penis and her vagina touched each other? No. Actually there was no sexual attraction going on, they were just, two regular hugs. Great. I'm curious was you even listening?